Hello, fellow Diamond Painting Addicts, and welcome back to Diamond Painting Anonymous. I'm Daphne, and I'm here today with an unboxing for you. Again, apologies for the audio and the uh, lighting. I'm filming from my hotel room, so this is what you get. Okay, so ap apologies again if you can hear the heater. Um, just apologies. Anyway, I'm not in my normal space, so here's what it is. Uh, I'm going to be unboxing a Dreamer Designs kit of mine, and this is my Penguin Trio. So I'm going to uh, start taking some of this off. I still for haven't remembered to go buy some scissors, so give me just a minute. I'm going to get the box open, and then I'll be back to share everything with you. This kit is one of the ones, and I'll stick a picture over there if I remember, um, that is on my artist series list so i'm excited about that uh it is a round i believe and so yeah it might be a square i don't know we'll open it and find out that's one of the things about dreamer designs it doesn't tell you whether it's round or square Oops, sorry from the box it just tells me it's a 30 by 40 so it's not very big but yeah let's just jump in be right back Okay, so I've got the plastic off the box. Let's get the box open, if I can. Okay, I've got the box open, so let's pull this out here and see what we get. So we get this nice branded box, or bag, with the purple ties. And let's see, here's our canvas, there's our toolkit, Here's our drills. Okay, so bag is empty. Put the drills aside, put the canvas aside. Let's see what we get in our little toolkit here. So we get this little branded bag. Oh my goodness, it all is in here. Oof, okay. Is that everything? Nope, there's more. Okay, this these bags are so soft. I wish you could feel them. They're just really nice and soft. Okay, so we get plenty of stuff. I've got two trays, two branded Dreamer Designs trays. I get a packet of baggies. I won't use those, but lots of you will find those helpful. We get some Super sharp tweezers. Guys, I bought tweezers. I could have just waited and opened this one. I'm gonna leave those out because I'll use those. Two purple scrunchies. Two of their branded wax. Just one plate of wax in each, but you can keep these little containers and put other circles of wax in them. So two circles of wax, which will be plenty. And then we get two pins. So I get one with a regular tip, one with a wax tip, or I guess this is more for special drills or something, which is interesting. Maybe it's just a different type. I've never had a pin like this one before. And then we get a three placer, a, oh, I'm dropping everything today, a six placer, and then a straightener, which, oh my gosh, you guys, I've missed having a straightener. The two pins that I grabbed, neither one of them has a straightener and I have missed it. So I will definitely be leaving that out as well so that I can use it. Um, okay, so that was what was in our little toolkit. So nice little toolkit. Good to know. All right, now let's look at our canvas. Oh, you guys, I don't have anything to measure this with. Oh, no. Okay, I forgot my measuring tool. Really should have thought this through. It's a very nice soft link canvas. Love that. <gasps> Do I get stickers? Oh, my gosh, that would be so helpful if I did. Okay, let me comes rolled up on this little piece of, oh, I do get stickers, you guys. Oh my gosh, you have no idea how happy that makes me because I'm traveling and I don't have all of my stuff. So I get my symbol, my number, and my DMC code. I've got 33 colors. Okay, so that's gonna be a bit of a challenge for me because I don't have a kit that will hold 33 different colors. I have my little QB containers, which only hold 28. So I'll have to see, maybe I wanna pick one that doesn't have very many drills and I can find some other little container to put them in. 
So we do get stickers, 33 colors. We get instructions. I won't use those. And then let me roll this the other way. You guys, this is so cute. Okay, so again, this is from Dreamer Designs. So we've got their little logo down here in the corner. Paint with passion. We do get a schematic on both sides. This says it is a 30 by 40, and it does say at the top that that is the design size. I will have to see if I can figure out a way to double check it. I don't have anything to measure with here in the hotel room. I'll have to see if I can find out. If not, I'll report back later. Okay, um, they've got all their socials up in the upper right hand corner. It is nice and sticky. Oh, and this is something Dreamer Designs does that I forgot, and that is around all the edges where their symbols are doesn't go all the way to the edge. There's like a little thin border, which I appreciate because if I wanna frame this and I wanna cut off all the white, that little border means that that part of it is gonna lay flat because there won't be drills on it, which makes it a little bit easier to actually frame. So yeah, super happy with that. And they're so cute. Look at these little cute guys. Now I get two ABs and they are, one is white, and one is green. So not the whites of their faces, but like the whites of the snowflake are an AB. And then a lot of the little greenery, um, not, oh, his scarf is an AB. So it's the scarf, it's not the greenery. It's the scarf that gets an AB. I don't know if I'll throw any extra ones in here because I'm not at home and I don't have access to any of my ABs. But if I don't get this done before we get home, then I might. We'll see, maybe I'll Maybe I'll throw some ABs in the star or something else. Yeah, I'll just have to see. Again, 33 colors. So let's open our drills. And again, apologies if my crinkling is too loud. I'm filming this with my headphones, my earbuds again. And yeah, just sometimes it doesn't work out the way I want. Okay. So let's look at our drills here and find the end. Ooh, got a short one, that one, and then this big long one. Okay, let's look at this. Nope, there's more than one. Okay. All right, so here we've got, it is a square kit. Okay, so we've got two bags of this blue, which is, I believe, the background color. So 21 is the, yeah, it's a lot of the blue in the background. And then we get a dark blue. Let's turn this over the other way. And then we get two shades of green. We get a dark green and then a lighter green. We get just a little bit of brown, some orange, ooh, some pretty pink some light pink, and some white. And then we get some purple. Is that black? Yes, so that bit of black. They're penguins, so of course there's gonna be black. Some navy blue, some blue, slightly lighter, some gray, some kind of dark red, a very dark purple, another dark blue, a gray, and then a very light green. And then we have another red, and then we get two shades of orange, a darker orange and a brighter orange. We get kind of an orange yellow, a plain, a bright yellow, and then a pale yellow, and then an off-white, kind of a minty green color, and then two shades of blue, which I'm gonna guess are probably background colors as well. That's more like just a sky blue. And then kind of a very pale wintry blue. And then our last colors, there is another shade of red, and we get two bags of just plain white, and then we get our two ABs. We've got our white ABs, and then we've got our green ABs, which looking at this, I guess that looks like enough drills. I'm looking at these green drills going, 
Hmm, does that look like enough to do all of his scarf? But it does, because I think that's the only place that these ABs get used. And I'll have to see once I do the white ABs. If I have enough, it might be fun to kind of sprinkle them in amongst the penguin white, the whites of their faces too, rather than just on the snowflakes and such. So we'll see, that may be something that has to wait until I get back home. So there you go, guys. This is, again, one of my kits from my artist series, my Penguin Trio. Uh, the artist is Jane Madey, and I got this one from Dreamer Designs. I'm so excited about this one. I have had my eye on this one for quite some time and just had never pulled the trigger on buying it. Yeah, I'm so happy I did, because I actually think, oh, I was going to say this one may be discontinued, but it might be a different one by that same artist. I think I was looking at one of hers that was like butterflies and birds. It may be that one that's being discontinued. I did also see, though, that they had restocked a bunch of kits. I got an email about that. So if you're interested in Dreamer Designs, check them out. They are in Canada, which is great for me because that means I still have access to good licensed diamond paintings. So hopefully the next time you see me, I will be uh, kitting this one up and getting ready to work on it in between visiting family and doing all the other things that we're doing while we're here. Thanks for sticking around to the end of the video, guys. Before you leave, don't forget to do all the things. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, and hit that bell notification icon so that you can be informed of future uploads. And as always, guys, thanks so much for watching.